the most amazing industrial manufacturing processes using modern machinery. Technology has always sparked the interest of the manufacturing business. The game-changing advantages of current technologies are assisting manufacturers a lot. They enhance productivity. There is less room for errors, and so on. These technologies can be from advanced robots to artificially intelligent machines and many more. So today, we will look at some of the fantastic processes done beautifully using modern technology. So be ready to get surprised! We will see how a perfect tennis racket is produced. After using resins to saturate the graphite sheet, they are then cut into shapes, mixed, and placed in a mold before being baked. Okay, when we say it is one of the most satisfying processes to watch, then we are not wrong. A two-step technique is used in the production of this kitchen sink, with the 304 grade stainless steel is pressed with the help of a production line. The drainer is then pressed with a separate sheet and welded with bolts in the following section. All of the joints are polished to guarantee a flawless finish. Also, we can observe a foam seal finish the product in the last part to ensure no water leakage. Have you ever wondered how cool looking these machetes are made? Well, the process is quite interesting. The steel is first finely cut into the machete shape. After being solidified in that furnace, it is dipped in oil. The piece is then marked, tempered, and laminated. After that, it is sharpened to create the final output. Semi-automatic machines are used to make pavers and machine blocks. The cement is delivered to a concrete mixer and molded into the desired shape. Wow, that looked amazing! Steel appliances are the most used products, but have you imagined how it is formed? The following video will exactly do that. The steel is passed through the assembly line and cut into shape by semi-automatic machines. Then, it is molded into shape and solidified. Profile machining is used to cut the PVC to build windows, and an automatic screw driving machine is used to install the screws. After that, the window assembly system will put all of the pieces together. This automatic system will blow your mind. In this video, the steel bar is heated, compressed, put into a mold, polished, and finally stamped to manufacture wrenches. The final process is galvanizing the twists with nickel. Installing overhead power lines is frequently less expensive than buried cables. However, with the help of a two-stage ratchet device, the ASCR cable cutter quickly cuts the ASCR cable. It is large enough to be operated with two hands. You might have used skewers, but what if we told you there is a much eco-friendly version? Big blocks of bamboo after being put in the automatic machines are cut into thin layers. It goes through this process two times, and then the knot is made via hands, and the packaging is finalized by assembly line production. Wooden cutlery is the new trend nowadays. Big logs of wood are turned into thin sheets with the help of machines. After that, these thin sheets are pressed and converted into spoons. One of the most used products in the kitchen is knife. Making this knife involves 40 steps, and each step is equally satisfying to watch. The steel is first compressed and then molded into a knife. After heating, it is cooled and polished via robotic technology.
Because the railway wheels must be sturdy, the manganese steel is molded first and then heat treated. They're finally painted and ready to go. That was so perfectly done! It might seem easy to manufacture matchsticks, but there's a whole process behind it. The logs are first converted into thin sheets and, with the help of machines, converted into tiny pieces that are later sieved and splints are removed. After that, the packaging is done. Razor blades are small in size, but they are of great use. The stainless steel is heated after being compressed into the blade shape. It is then cooled in a cooling chamber before being heated again. After they are grinded, polished, and strips are cut, finally, it is coated with Teflon and is backed by an automatic packing machine. You know, what measures the safety of any vehicle? A sturdy tire. Here, a thread rubber is glued to the truck tire body. Enveloping is a procedure of attaching this rubber to the tire with the use of a machine. Then, it goes through a series of inspections and then it is ready to roll on the road. This continuous process is a treat to watch. To make a bottle, a glass is put into a hot furnace and turned into lava. It is molded into the shape of the bottle. The paper is automatically sorted by machines and is converted into the shape of a cup. After that, one by one, the outer covering is attached by the machine. Have you given thought to how croissant is made? The dough is churned and kneaded in the automatic machine. After that, it is flattened and converted into the shape of a croissant. Then it is baked. Here, the mixture of graphite and clay is converted into thin pencil leads. Then it is dried, heated, and then dipped in wax. To everyone's liking, the rubber is converted to two half circles that are combined to form one ball. After that, the ball is covered in a green coating. And then your tennis ball is ready. You'll be so pleased to see how thermoplastics are made. The tools are well placed, and the plastic sheet is clamped and heated to the temperature required for shaping. The plastic vacuums onto the device once it reaches a desired temperature. In this video, we will see how socket heads are made. The iron is put inside the machine, where it is converted into a socket head. After heating and then cooling, the product is ready. Let's take a look at the processes of making a steel drum. The steel is pressed into a sheet, after which the upper and lower lid of the drum is made. And then after the formation of the body, it is heated. The process of shoemaking requires precision. The rubber is put into the mold, and then it is pressed and heated. After that, the four rubber is added, and the process is repeated. Lipstick is one of the most used cosmetic products, and its manufacturing process is enjoyable to watch. The colored liquid is placed into the mold, and after that, it is heated and fitted into the cover. So guys, that's it for today. So now we know how incredible these manufacturing processes are. And, thanks to modern technology, the process has been made quite simple. 
we can say that the overall production and profitability are likely to improve as businesses continue to employ these modern technologies to regulate all parts of the production process. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel to get more content like this. We will see you in our next video. Until then, bye and take care.